Jackie X. Eight wins in Formula One. Endurance world champion. Six times winner of the 24 Hours of Le Mans. And as ever here, partnered with Claude Brasseur. To Jackie and Claude, good luck. 1983 and a third Dakar appearance for Jackie X and Claude Brasseur. That year they'd go on to win in their Mercedes after an unforgettable first journey across the Tenere, the desert of deserts. The ninth stage, Turku to Agadez, will remain forever in the event's history. Aller dans le Tenere, euh, to travel the Tenere, it's a unique challenge. Immense. It's Et immense. Ça vous and it makes you aware of your true size in the wide open space. La petitesse de l'individu. The smallness in the midst of that vastness. It's incredible. L'événement de cette année-là, c'est que the event that year we drove through a sandstorm with approximate bearings. Everything then was done by sight, and we knew a compass in the desert within a few degrees itself was not spot on. The focus of navigation, it's a mountain, a shadow, a river. At one point, we got caught in a fog coming out of the desert. At the tree of Tenere, we couldn't see a thing. There's a chance to regroup, but then the question is, do we neutralize the stage? The response from the boss, out of the question. So we had to get ourselves together. Some will get lost, find themselves being welcomed by the Tuareg tribes. Everyone is found, but it was such an incredible fog, it shows you you should never give up. During that stage, I had difficulty with an engine setting. It was far, far back. But with a little skill, a little success, some luck, Despite everything, we came second on the stage when I thought we'd finish an hour and a half behind everyone. The camp is where? The campsite? Petrol is straight ahead. I don't need any. Then the campsite is to your immediate left. When you have the fortune of a great machine, to be surrounded by some mechanics, good preparation, you can arrive at the end. So, it's incredible luck when you go on and win the whole rally. For comparison, it's nothing like the 24 hours of Le Mans. It's a true challenge to have lived something so rare, unheard of. And when you do it with a guy like Thierry Sabine, it's really, really special. There's a sporting challenge and, above all, there's a horizon that opens up before you. We discover new countries, new people, another culture, other ways of living. Even if we pass by quickly, it's to say it's really special.